I was planning on finishing it before we go. Oh? So what are we about to do? We're about to eat Fear Farm's, I guess, top three. It's basically the people at Fear Farm are really nice. They gave these to us just because, well, we were picking the we so we picked out the thing that Narcid Narcity post posted, and then we asked them what's like the the next other the best other things they have. So they recommended, uh, other than their Cinnabon, they recommended their dessert brownie. Yeah. So this is like a score brownie. So, score brownie, and then the apple crumble, apple pie, and then this now famous um, cinnamon roll with pumpkin spice icing. Okay, so first of all, Fear Farm was so nice to us. Like, so nice to us. Really we nice. went in there, like, ready to pay. Like, they had already treated us like royalty, beyond belief. They were so nice, the family, like, run haunted, park and it's way better than anything else we've ever done mm -hmm. um, literally they didn't need to treat us like that at all we love that place you'll see in the footage yeah it was such a good experience <laughs> yeah. and I, I literally went to the bakery to buy these things I literally told Craig halfway through the event I'm like I have to get this because this is what's trending online right now um, there's cinnamon bun with pumpkin spice icing it's all made fresh like she yeah. literally starts in the morning works there all night makes these fresh to order, like pretty much fresh to order. They told us that sometimes she works like 18 hours at a time. Yeah. Like that's a lot of work. And she was so nice too. Every, this, that whole place, it was just so nice <laughs> to finally, like just, just be there and be a part of something that like, you can literally be like, this is the best thing ever. Yeah. And like fully, fully, fully mean it and support it. Like this, you have to go, to Fear Farm, even just going there in the day for their regular day event and their bakery. They have like go-karts and pay. Yeah. Them. Like they have everything. And then once n six o'clock hits, that's when like the the haunt thing starts and it's just crazy. Yeah. Uh, I'm super excited. I feel like we have to say, it. let's start with the score brownie. Okay, where are our forks that we grabbed? Right here. I don't know why I grabbed three. Yeah. Score brownie. Watch as it falls all over the car. It looks amazing. Okay, so go. Oh, you're gonna make me do something. I feel like it's not gonna work. Oh my god, that looks so soft. <laughs> I can't even grab it. Oh my god, it's soft. Also, keep in mind that this just came an hour drive. Yeah. From, so they've been sitting for like an hour and a bit. Cheers. It's okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. So that's really good. <laughs> oh my god. And like we were like, okay, we'll save the best for last. Oh my god. I could eat that for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, I have no idea how we're gonna eat that. I guess just we'll eat the filling. Stab it. Yeah. So this is the apple crumble. Again, snydersfarms.com. It looks like you can order this stuff too. I'm ordering it for my birthday then. Which isn't for a while, but whatever. Brennan trying to open a package for five minutes straight. Five hours later. When they ASMR I guess I'll show. So this is the apple crumble. It's like a mukbang in a car. <laughs> Trisha Paytas is sh shaking, quaking. Oh my god. It's 
gonna fall all over the place. That looks so good! The way you got that. Hurry, 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 and it's in my hand. Okay. <laughs> it tastes like a professional bakery. Well, it kinda is. Did you, the, okay, so. Oh yeah, the, the back story, story. The back story to how they scored this like amazing baker is this uh, woman who makes, oh my God, I just got the cinnamon flavor after that. Who makes really good food apparently. <laughs> wow. So she had her own bakery and Snyder's Farm and Fear Farm, they, uh, they loved her and they loved her food. So they literally approached her and was like, close shop and come on the farm and like, you know, bake what you bake here. And, and it worked. It worked. Oh my God. Oh my God, I'm the best for last. <laughs> okay. So as seen, on Narcity. On Narcity Canada, Answer the pumpkin post. pie spice cinnamon roll. You're making me really nervous it's gonna fall. I would cry right now <laughs> if we didn't get to eat this. Oh my god, smell that. Ooh. Okay, bye, you can go home. I mean, I can walk, it's not that far. <laughs> okay. I don't even know what to... It. Craig, I tried to uh, cut this for five minutes straight. Okay, for a cinnamon roll, and especially being an hour old, it's still so soft. Mm -hmm. I think I just only got icing. You gotta stab it like three different times. and I'm struggling. <laughs> oh my god. This is too much. Oh my god. Should I do it? I'm gonna do it. I'll do it, but just eat it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the whole thing's gone. I look away for five seconds. There's like literally a fourth of it missing. <laughs> oh Holy my shit. god. We're on our way back to grab, <laughs> grab, a, grab a couple more. That was really good. Is worth a drive, literally, to just go there and pick <laughs> up their, get their food, just to get their food. <laughs> now the rest of us is just us eating like pigs. <laughs> oh my god! Fear Farm. Not only do you have an amazing event, which you'll see in another video, you have amazing food! You know, it's funny, usually we throw out the extra food after a mukbang, we can't throw this out. Mm -mm. I don't care what you gotta do, put it in the fridge, put it in the freezer, chronically, cryogenically freeze it, I Did don't you get care. a second bite? No, oh. I didn't even, I, I think my first bite counted I thought you were five. going for a second bite. No, I wasn't, I wasn't. Oh, do you want another one? Yes. Yes, he does. Yeah, I'm gonna end up eating another half of it. That happened by accident. Whatever, save me calories. I actually at this moment, that is not what I want. I do not want to be saved calories from this. Not from this. <sighs> the icing, it's like the spice. Oh my God. It tastes like they literally took pumpkin pie. Okay, it doesn't just taste like nutmeg, cinnamon, and sugar in whipped cream, like what most places do. It literally tastes like a pumpkin pie tastes in like, icing form on top of a cinnamon roll that was freshly made. It tastes like heaven on a platter is what it is. It's so good, and the cinnamon roll, oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's so good! You can take this, take wow. this away from me. We gotta hide, people are gonna break into our car. We gotta hide this. I was planning on finishing it before we go. Oh. I was gonna lock you out of the car. <laughs> oh, I have a button on my side. I took off. <laughs> I could have left. You see me running? It's just like a scene of me bolting across the parking lot. <laughs> I could have taken the car and left. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be even funnier. You got the two on the right up. <laughs> wow, okay. Well, it must be good. I've never seen a move that quickly. 
huge thank you to Fear <laughs> Farm. I don't know. I heard like a, a cop, like you know when how they have those. Oh, yeah, just oh. right there. Huge thank you to Fear Farm for everything and Snyder's Farm and that amazing baker baker for making this food. Like it was so good, so good. And now we're here at Wonderland where they sell French fries that are literally ugh which and have chicken hurry. fingers which are ugh. Which we're gonna have to hurry if we actually want to eat food there. Oh, Craig is hungry because he got scared again. You'll see it in the footage. Oh, there's Craig fiddling around with things again. <laughs> For those that hang out with Craig, he like literally will break things apart, chew on them. He's always got something in his mouth, whether it's like the... He'll literally like... Oh, see? Here's an example. Here's his Red Bull can, and the top of it has been chewed off. <laughs> That's Craig. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> and there's the thumbnail. Ew! Okay. Ew! <laughs> Go get out of the car this time. <laughs> no, you're gonna take my car. Okay, we have to hide this and go into Wonderland and get out of my car. It stinks. Wait, you're about to fart again. We're not gonna eat it? No, because we gotta go into Wonderland. I might don't know why my voice went so high there. <laughs> no, we gotta go into Wonderland. Oh my god, but huge thank you again. That was amazing. You guys were absolutely went above and beyond with treating us like I honestly felt like I was a part of their family. Uh-oh. Craig. <laughs> I was hoping you you know it's good when. <laughs> I was hoping you wouldn't notice. You know it's good when. Um, huge thank you. Thank you. Honestly, thank, thank you. Thank you. It was such a good event. The food's amazing. Like, literally kept trying to offer us food throughout the day, too. Like, water bottles, food. Like, it was just amazing. Thank you. It was so awesome to be part of a family setting and a family business. It really business. feels like you're part of a family. Yeah, it felt like we were a part of the family. And, like, honestly, like, Huge thank you. The food's amazing. There's there's no like you spoiling us and that's why we're giving you a good review. The food's actually amazing. Um, I know I'll be making a trip up before the end of the season to grab a couple more of those cinnamon rolls. <laughs> <laughs> November 2nd they said that they shut down the Fear Farm, right? And then they go yep. into a three week transition for their Christmas event. I gotta go there for the Christmas food. What the hell is Christmas food? Christmas sweets and desserts. Can you imagine what that baker and that woman could do? Oh my god. I just hope you know. No, oh, oh. I'm gonna be farting up a storm because my body does not digest chocolate very well. Anyway, where'd you put this? Ow. <laughs> just like the security guard thing. He <laughs> all cool in front of security, then you fell. Okay, all stuff aside that i think is my favorite dessert i've had to date and i've eaten at some pretty fancy restaurants especially in orlando and stuff that is I my favorite been, dessert yeah. i've ever had and my mom makes a mean cheesecake pumpkin pie which i need to try because i love cheesecake and i love pumpkin pie are you coming to thanksgiving dinner tomorrow can i <laughs> do you want to i mean i can <laughs> can i yeah i can oh um i guess that's <laughs> it for this video i had a Honestly, when you guys see the footage, yeah, we had a blast there for real. Craig on the drive there. Oh my god, that aside, that's a separate video. Yeah, the food, no this video either. is about the food. Honestly, amazing, amazing. I'm not saying that you gotta go. Even if you're if you're afraid of haunts, they have the day event. Yeah, you can literally like go into the bakery. The bakery's outside of the actual haunted event, so you don't even need a ticket to go to the bakery. Yeah, that's you true, just go actually. to the. It's amazing. You gotta go check it out. And the website, in case you don't. It looks like you can order it online. It is snydersfarm.com. S N Y D E R S F A R M.com. Snydersfarm.com. Link down below. Link down below. Honestly, they deserve it. Absolutely amazing. It's just the best part about there is you feel like you're valued. Because it's not a, a corporation, it's a family. So whatever you say, they take it to heart and they mm -hmm. will fix it and they will... And they kept asking our opinion. Yeah. Like, they literally were like, how did you like it? Like, like off camera. Too. Yeah, off camera. Like, literally, like, how did you like it? Is everything good? It, it, like, oh. Like, you can tell their number one priority isn't money. It's guest, it's guests, yeah. guest, hap guest yeah. happiness, whatever the word it's is. It's art to them. Yeah, and we'll, we'll, so we're gonna make a review video. So we're gonna have our video, and then we're gonna do a review of it. You'll you'll see the whole story. It is art to them. Literally every mm -hmm. piece of haunted attraction at that place is it's, art. 
is built by them or they bought an expensive animatronic. But if it's not an animatronic, they built it by hand. Yep. And it's a family. You like, gotta go. The mazes are literally like trailers, like 18-wheeler trailers, cut open, combined together. Like, mm -hmm. there's six of them. And it's and, and it's like a 10-minute maze. It, yeah, it's like a 10-minute maze. And you look at it, and you're like, that must only be a minute or two Trailers long. are only, what, a meter and a half, two meters, three meters wide? wide yeah. There's like four or five of them lined up and you're in there for 10 minutes. I don't know how they do it. And it doesn't feel like you're just going back and forth. Like you're going different directions. Mm -hmm. oh, I feel like we're, we're accidentally doing the review. Uh, that, yeah. That's how this, this is. This is how is. blown away we were. All right. We're going to go to Halloween Haunt for the rest of the night. I think we got like an hour and a half left. We're just going to go in, grab food, and talk to the Yukon team because we love them. Um... You got it. This? Next year, we are doing a meetup at that park. Like, one or two meetups. And that we need to get as many people as we know there. to that event. You have to experience it. You will not want to do any other Halloween event if once you experience that. And, I, okay, the question they asked, I loved it. Okay, so they asked us. See, we're accidentally doing the review. We'll save that for the review. Sorry, I keep getting wrapped up. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't, which you should. I'm kidding. Um, and share this video for others to enjoy. Fuck, I dropped my fork. Or at least what's left of it. Pasta la vista. Bye. Can we go to Wonderland now? Yeah. <laughs>